Hi, I'm Lisa Townsend, Surrey's Police and Crime Commissioner. Thank you so much for taking the time to read my newsletter. It covers the work that my team and I have been doing throughout the last month. During December and January, I've been asking you what you'd be prepared to pay towards policing from your council tax. That goes towards the grant from central government to fund Surrey Police in the year ahead. In early February, the Police and Crime panel accepted my proposal to raise the precept, the policing part of your council tax, by £13 a year based on a bandy property. And you can now see how much you'll pay by visiting the council tax page of my website. I am grateful for the majority of residents who supported the increase, which is crucial for Surrey's Chief Constable, Tim DeMayer, to have the tools he needs to take the fight to the criminals. And I want to thank everybody who took time to contribute to that survey. Your answers and comments are also important to help inform the direction of our office and Surrey Police in the months ahead. Elsewhere, I joined response officers working from Staines for a Sunday shift and you can watch a video on that below. I also travelled to Reigate to address residents following the series of Policing Your Community events that the Chief Constable and I took part in all around the county. Speaking with you and hearing more about your concerns is a key part of my role and I'd encourage anyone who'd like to speak to me to join me at one of my monthly surgeries. We're grateful for your views of the events across Surrey and we're working with the force to incorporate your feedback into our activity in the months ahead. Elsewhere, my deputy, Ellie Vasey thompson visited a swan sanctuary in Shepparton to learn more about a spate of catapult attacks on these beautiful birds. Both Ellie and I believe the sale of catapults should be banned without a licence and we are joining calls to change the law on this crucial issue. Finally, I shared a video on romance fraud to mark Valentine's Day. And I would urge anybody who believes that they've been a victim of a romance fraudster or if you know somebody and you're worried about somebody who has been, please get in touch with Surrey Police. I can assure you that they will treat your case sensitively and carefully and nobody is going to judge you for what you may have been through. Thank you once again for your time and for watching my video and for reading my newsletter. As always, if there's anything that you want to contact me or the team about, you can get in touch with us via the website.